Hi guys, so welcome back to my channel. You may recognize me again, Emma. <laughs> we're actually on a trip with Benefit. Literally, Emma just had a shower, I just had a bath, and we're in our dressing gowns and Best we're gonna get shower ready. Ever. We had freaking free settings. Oh my god, one of them's like a waterfall, one of them did that all crisscrossy <laughs> stuff. I'm just like a more shower. But, but, but yeah, still. the waterfall one was sick though, weren't it? It literally dropped out, it was amazing. Although it was no, I was surprised I didn't get my hair wet because that oh. shower head thing was like this long. <laughs> and I was sure my body like leaning back, like, <laughs> Let's get cracking. An hour. An hour to do this. Okay, so what are you going to start off with? Should we start off with your eyes or face? I will start from my brows, then I? So I'm going to start off with my eyes. routine. I'm taking P. Louise base. This is in 0.5. I'm so glad I got my brows on today, even though I did it. I actually feel like a little woman. I'm going to take my Modern Renaissance palette, Raw Sienna. Okay, so I'm going to go and use... Mm, what <laughs> 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 my neck, my back, lick my mm, mm, and my. Okay, so I'm gonna use this born this way sculpting concealer in the shade snow. Okay, I'm gonna start blending out that eyeshadow now. So the other day, me and Emma, what day was it? Oh. Friday. Friday. We went to this place called Bally Ballisons in Shoreditch. So before we went to Nubo, Nobu, 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 which, which is like a Japanese style restaurant in it. It yeah. was so nice. Oh it was tasty, but nice. I think it's overrated. One hundred percent for the price. Like between yeah. us, it comes. Like I found a, like a bit of a, a, a place I want that I said you go going to the Aqua Go. Aqua, yeah, and I found that sticks and sounds tastier. Yeah, one hundred percent. We definitely need to go other places than that, don't we? Really? Like the food was nice because we really love sushi, but we wasn't like. I'd love it, you know. Um, we went to Bally Ballisons. It's like a cocktail pub. I do like funky cocktails. Like you, I had like a um, Skittles cocktail and a Paul Star Martini. Yeah. Um, and then you had like a dip damp one with it. Yeah, like, the sherbet. Like, like the sherbet sweets and lollies and stuff in it. So they do like quite funky stuff. But they have like two ball pits. Like one's at the front, which is a bit smaller, and then one's at the back. Oh my god, you in that ball pit was just hilarious. Like we went in the ball pit festival. We didn't realize how deep it was, and Sabrina was like, "I'm only little." <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she's just laughing, like floating further away from me in the ball. Yeah, but you're like, you're, like trying trying get, you're trying to get up, you're pushing me down, so I'm like going down. It's literally, honestly, you you have to have been there, like it was hilarious. It was crazy. We went into the smaller ball pit, okay? This one's not too big, so we went into the smaller ball pit. It had like red and black balls, didn't it? Yeah, and it was near like the window, so yeah. people were walking by. They're like, getting off the bus, and there's us like this ball pit, like in front of ourselves back. <laughs> Like, obviously not just us, some people in there as well. Yeah. But, but I got balls and I threw them at the window. <laughs> I was like <laughs> Emma actually lost her phone in the ball pit. Do you know what happened, right? It sounds like I obviously had my phone out because he was taking pictures and stuff. But like and then that then that boy and that guy, um woman, sorry, was like oh, yeah, the couples. Mm -hmm. So I was like, oh my god, I'm really not in there. I'm so tired, I was like not in the mood to have balls thrown at me because it's effort to like try and like dodge them and stuff all the time. <laughs> so we tried to get up. Um, and as I got up, I just completely forgot that like, my phone was on my lap because I was more trying to concentrate on how to get up out of this ball pit. Yeah. So I went to the toilet and I was like, Sabrina, I said, my phone! So we literally went back into the ball pit and like, we were trying to find this phone and like, literally called onto the floor like, trying to put our things there. She's always going to tell you, probably for the 20th time, what happened so, to her. I was like, okay, we need to start feeling around the bottom of it. What are you looking for? My phone! <laughs> By the way, guys, I'm gonna go in with Cypress Umba, which is this dark brown shade here. For oh, fuck's sake. Pardon me. You dirty tramp. <laughs> I've had this all weekend, guys. I think she's sick of hearing me burp now. I'm not joking with you. If you know me, you know I'm a burp. I was running my hands along the bottom of the ball pit to try and find the phone. But as I ran my hands along, my finger kind of went back. So there's a lot of balls in there. <laughs> 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 and my now bent backwards and flinged off and then as I come up it was low and it was bleeding I was like oh my god and you know when like her face think, was a picture if you have like long acrylic nails yet like these I think you you know that pain like you know that pain and you just kind of freeze I'm just there like mm. And I just had to kind of give myself a minute, didn't I? <laughs> um, even though it meant breaking it down. But she was shock about a fucking medal. <laughs> and they were fresh on. They were fresh on that week. I'd got them done and they looked so nice. And then I broke my nail. But then it just kind of taught me that I think I might get them a little bit shorter next time. <laughs> <laughs> and then this guy and his friends that are chucking balls at us. Oh my god, I've got the funniest boomerangs ever on you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to have to send them so you can insert. Oh my god, okay. <laughs> we're insert some now. 
Did you like them? <laughs> They're how angry I was getting, was it? And I was like, because he got me right on my cheek. And when I say he pelted the ball, it like pinged. I heard the noise. And we was tired as well. We was like, no, please just leave us alone. Yeah, because he was probably and he was like, And around. he was like, give me your hand. Yeah. So like, I help you out. And then he helped me out. And he pushed me back down again. I was like, and the more you push it down, you'd sink yeah, it. Yeah, and you were like, and I was just like, just leave me, just leave me alone. And then I was whimpering you myself, and I see, then I see Sabrina just get launched. <laughs> Chucking us around so much, the um, bar person gave me a plaster, and I lost my plaster in the ball bit. <laughs> and what else did he give you? A free drink. <laughs> Actually, let me justify that. Let me justify that because they might be like, it's really, you're in a relationship. Um, so basically, I went to the bar and I said, like, um, do you have any plasters, please? Because my nail just broke off and it's like bleeding. Um, and he was like, yeah, no worries. So he went and got one. He put this card thing with him. And then I was like, oh, once I put the plasters on, I was like, what's this card? And I looked at it. It's and it was you. like, I think you're cute. Like, get a free shot on us or something like that. Did you give me this? I said, because you feel sorry about my nail. <laughs> do you remember? Yeah, and he was like, I think you're cute. <laughs> no, I think it, I was like, Oh, <laughs> and, and I walked away. I see her about ten years. She must have thought, yeah, she was like, yeah, in a relationship for ten years. When he asked for my number, I was like, sorry, I've been in a relationship for like ten years. And um, he was like, yeah, it's fine. I'm literally just using, um, I'm using my Stacey Marie Carnival palette, which I absolutely love. The colours in it are oh, just insane. So if you haven't got one, don't you think you need this in your life? I'm gonna spritz my brush right now, and I'm gonna go in with one of the new Marc Jacobs sequins. These are like a foiled glitter eyeshadow, but they have a lot of fallout. Topaz flash. It looks like that. It's just a really gorgeous, like brownie color. Really Isn't that so pretty? Today we done archery. I mean, I sculpt in. I was quite good at archery, man. Like, yeah, I'm not gonna lie. Was, but yeah. I was quite good at that. Same. I was sick. <laughs> and I'm not saying so myself. <laughs> and My scores <laughs> reflected that. <laughs> Put up. So I've got some Sleek Intense Water Liner. This is really, really good, guys. Like, I think this is becoming one of my favorite liners. It's so creamy. So I'm gonna put that on my top and my bottom eyelashes. Gonna do a little bit of smoky stuff. I'm using this one, yeah? Actually, I'm using the dark one. I don't know which one to use. The dark one's a light one. The dark one's more pink you. Yeah. My lashes, I'm using the Mykonos Foam Ink by Lily Lashes. Now onto the other eye. Oh my god, so some of our like influencers, YouTubers and all that have been taken to Lapland by GHD. Oh my god, look how sick oh, that yeah. looks. It looks so nice. Wow. That's so freaking cool. I have to say though, I have to give a major shout out to Benefit and the whole team because they always do incredible um, events and press trips. I'm gonna let those get a little bit tacky. Never dry. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, yeah. <laughs> so true, isn't it? <laughs> With this duo glue, quick set strip lash adhesive. Oh my gosh, this this stuff dries fast. Three times this morning I had to put glue on my eyelashes because it's that fast. So I'm gonna go in with Benefit Professional. I don't ever feel like I need a lot of this product, but I just like to use it around like my creases. Oh, I don't like it. <laughs> well, you're not liking your makeup. I think, I think so at the minute it's just because I just stopped coming together and I know we've got that short on time. I just think. That's the thing, when you've got a short on time, you're stressing it. Don't worry, when you've done it, I can add any final touches anyway. Charlotte Tilbury Hollywood Flawless Filter. This is in shade 5 Tan. And then I'm gonna use the Givenchy Velvet Foundation. This is in the shade Matte Ginger. So I'm gonna go in with this one. There, a little bit on the forehead, not too much. Not too much, she Not says. too much, you've used the old bottle. <laughs> Get me NYX. Glitter primer. All right, so let's just ask some random questions then. Mainly for Emma. <laughs> but Emma, have you ever used Tinder? No. Never. 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 Have you ever used any dating website stuff? Um, I used a site called Bumble before, but I've heard that. Is that what you women pick the men? Yeah, but do you know what? I like, I literally was on it for about twenty-four hours, if that. Stop it. Because I just hate that fake conversation. That like, I can't, I can't do with that. If you want to do it, hats off. But personally, it's just not really luck for me. So I'm gonna go in with the Too Faced Multi Sculpt Born This Way Concealer. This is in um, warm beige. I'm gonna go like that and up as well. But I'm now taking my NARS Radiant Primer. Love if you one. know, see, yeah. she knows. That <laughs> <laughs> I absolutely love this. Um, nearly running out but yeah it's amazing and if you use the NARS sheer glow best combination ever like ever like no nah, I can't even explain it <laughs> okay so because of Serena I went to the Too Faced store at 
blue water. She obviously loves this foundation, which is the Born This Way foundation. You yeah, haven't heard of my baby already, you know. And actually, my other foundation's actually running out, so you know, it doesn't get, I don't get paid yet. So I'm being tight and using a tester. To be fair, I love the Born This Way foundation. Like, I literally have it right here. The only reason I haven't used it is I'm trying to not let that be the only foundation that I go for. Oh my god, I she's going to be Oh my god. I'm going to use Lottie London Tan Time Bronzer. A few moments later. More moments later. I clearly forgot about my eyelashes once again. It's fine. This is just typical. So now I've got to find my eyelash glue. Where is it? I'm going to use my eyelash glue. Once again, I just want to point out the colour of me is putting more down to the camera than my actual makeup. So bring it really close onto your nose to about here. <coughs> <laughs> this is the Pretty in USA Blush Bronzer and Brows Palette by Benefit. And you've got Hula, Rocketeur, and Dandelion Twinkle. So I'm going to use Hula out of it and Rocketeur. I'm going to use Hula to do a little bit of contour. And you do have a goof proof brow okay. pencil there as well. I'm going along and pushing that up. I'm going to grab a smaller brush. Basically, I'm doing the exact same nose contour that I did in the catfish video, but just. Probably not as harsh, like, let's be real, this is... Does it actually hurt your back like this, doesn't it? Jeez. It does, yeah. But we have to be quite close to the camera because we're a little bit far. Once again, I'm trying to find my lash glue and everything. Oh my god, look at my face. Look, no, this has got... I'm going to get abused. So I'm going to grab a brush right now. No, I'm not. Oh my god, I'm going to put my eyelashes on. God, why am I so bad at remembering to put my freaking eyelashes on? Everything's testing me, my life. Oh, me. I think I got blue in my eye. Dole Lash in the style Gloria. I actually really like these. They're about the glam ones, but they're not that thick glam ones. Okay, so I'm gonna just wipe away real quick the powder that's been sitting on my nose a little bit. Oh, look how much nicer that is, guys. By the way, I'm adding the Rocketeur blush from Benefit. I'm gonna take the same palette that she used, because I got one too. And uh, <laughs> and uh, well, I'm just trying to keep mine clean. I don't really like using new stuff. I don't know why that is. I know she actually hates using new stuff. She wants to like keep it new forever. Okay, so what do I do with this? Use my actual contour, yeah. Like, yeah. So angle it the other way. Lighten that up a little bit. So really tap that off. Look that way for me. And then you just want to start from the corner and just go along a little circular motion and flicking that up the head down a little bit. That's I'm gonna go in with Bare Minerals Pro Performance Powder in Teak. And basically, because this is like a foundation powder, but it's a lot darker, you feel like a bronzer. It helps if you didn't know already. Out. Yeah, I mean, I can do all the five videos. <laughs> Every video, you know. Um, so I'm just gonna go around, like, it really helps blend things out and soften things because it's like a foundation powder, but it's like bronzy. Okay, I'm taking this, I'm taking my Shade and Light Kat Von D palette. I'm just literally using the powder, powder thing in it. I don't know what you call it, I'm not a YouTuber. And then I'm literally just gonna use it to like swipe off like the actual um, translucent setting palette that I've got on there already. I'm gonna grab my Modern Renaissance palette and I'm gonna go in with the first shade that we use, which is, and we're just gonna use a small brush. We're gonna press that right along the lash line. We also have some product left on this regardless but I'd like to press that in first of all before I do anything. I'm going to do down here so we go from there all the way down the side and you bring it into the arch of your eyebrow. Oh my god stop reminding me! <laughs> <laughs> Time is running out! We're both just smoking out our bottom lash lines right now. I'm going to do it with a bit of black as well. Isn't it? Yeah why not? I'm actually just putting this spring of sleek pencil um, on my waterline. I'm gonna take the Body Shop Clear Mascara, which I'm gonna use on my eyebrows, and then I'm gonna take the Benefit Precisely Brow in the shade 4.5. I've actually been liking this and shade four more so than shade five. I always use shade five, but I think I might prefer this now. And then I'm actually gonna take shade five in the Gimme Brow, love this stuff. So they're my free little products. The only reason why I'm using this clear one is just to brush through any product that might be just chilling on them from the foundation and stuff. And I'm gonna take that. my empty bronzer, which yeah, that's okay, it's all running out, everything's running out, oh my god, I'm just going to go over my face, start from the arch, do my neck, <laughs> okay, so I'm just going to take the um, Rocketure um, blusher and just quickly just put that on my face, because I do love a bit of blush, I'm just going to borrow Sabrina's primer water and spray my face. Shut up. <laughs> okay, now 
sprayed my face, I'm actually going to put my highlighter on and use my favourite highlighter, which is the Ofra Star Island highlighter. You ready for this? You ready? They're not ready. Then me, I'm just blinded everyone. And then obviously, I'm going to take my nose. Like precisely brow and gimme brow are just life. Like I just love them. Okay, so I'm just going to use this little vice pencil that I've literally used to death out compared to all my other lip liners. So, and then I'm also going to take um, Mac Peach Blossom lipstick and just put it all over the top. And it's really nice, actually. Like. Nude. I just used this Maybelline Matte Ink, and you know what? This is in 75 Vita, so really orangey brown. But I start that off as my base, and then I add like other colours into it. I've still got a highlighter. I'm gonna go in with the Little Mix Matte Lip in the shade I'm in so deep. Quite a nice orangey colour, so I think it will go quite well with this. So I'm just gonna dab that in the center. Dab dab. Then I'm gonna go in with Peach Stock in the center of the lips again. Okay, I'm gonna use OPV um, highlighter in Glamorous. Okay, I'm then, I'm basically finished. We're gonna finish first. <laughs> I'm just gonna take primer water again and just reset really over my face because I'm not supposed to do it. <laughs> Right guys, we're gonna quickly do our hair, get dressed, go downstairs. I am vlogging this. Are they really nice? They're from the airport. Are they really nice? They're like eight pounds. Have them set? Yeah, they're not really nice, aren't they? I really like them. See you in two. God, we're so cringe. So we are ready now. I'm gonna be showing you my outfit. This is my face. And we're gonna give you a full look, head to toe. And I'm gonna to do Emma, and then you're gonna see me. Emma, take it away. Okay, so just wear this blazer that I got from Boohoo, um, Primark leather jeans, and then my boots that I got from Public Designer. Public Desire? <laughs> I look designer. Um, and that's it really. <laughs> just curled my hair with a Mark Hill curling wand. Just went over it briefly within like, like seven minutes. And we are done. And then this is my eyes. Don't judge my makeup, but yeah. <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> you guys seen my makeup? This is my dress. It's from Old Polly. By the way, that is a floor creak and that is not me. Um, yeah, so it's just like a very simple kind of like green bodycon dress. I got these shoes, which are like... Perspex. Through. That's it. Perspex shoes. This is my dress. And this is my makeup. As always guys, thank you so much for watching. You can see our makeup up close and personal now. If you have enjoyed it, give it a big thumbs up and subscribe. Comment down below for more. Get ready with us and we'll see you very soon. See you soon. Bye. Bye.